So, good afternoon, guys. We will see another program that is finding the squares of all even numbers in the given list. Finding the squares of all even numbers, guys. Okay. So, write a program, write a program to find the squares, squares of all all even numbers in the even list okay in the list now let's take a list which contains both even numbers odd numbers like a 5 2 8 or 6 or 9 something 10 like this there are some numbers both even numbers odd numbers now from this list we have to fetch only even numbers from the even numbers for the even numbers we find out uh, the squares so first we get one by one, right? We get one by one and check it, uh, is it even or not? If it is even, then find the square. First of all, we take the five, check it now, is it even or odd? It is odd, so leave it. Next, uh, second one, uh, two is coming, is it even or odd? It is even, then find the square. Find the square, two square, four, four. Next one, uh, eight is coming, eight is even or odd? It is the even. So then uh, for eight, uh, square is uh, 64, 64. Next, uh, uh, let's take uh, an odd number also, guys, here, something uh, seven like this. Next, seven is coming. For seven, uh, is it even or odd? It is the odd, leave it. A six is taking, and a six is even or odd? It is the even number. Then uh, find the square, 36. Next, nine is coming. Is it even or odd? It's the odd number. Leave it. Next one, 10 is coming. It is even number. Then 10 oh. square, 100. That all I want to keep in the square. List format, right? List format like this. This is the required output uh, from the given input. From the given input, right? So for that one, first of all, apply for loop for LST. For LST. Now, what's first time I value? First time I value is the 5. Now, is it even number, odd number? We have to check it. Uh, so take the if condition. If that i modulus 2 equal to 0, if it is even number, then uh, for that i, I'm going to find out, uh, okay, uh, square value. We can take the i into i, i into i. Okay, next time, uh, so i value 1 by 1 coming, right? i value next time 2 is coming. So if it is even number, then find the square. Next, uh, so 8 is coming, uh, I value 8, uh, if it's even number, then find the square. At 7, I value 7, so if it's even number, find the square, but odd number, it will skip, uh, no finding square. Next, I value is the 6, it is even number, find the square. Next, I value is 9, I value is the 9, it is not even number, skip it. Next, I value is the 10. It is the even number, then find the square. After all over, after all over, then I am going to print it. We are going to print it and execute it. Right, you can see the result also, right? The result also came here. All right, so one by one coming. For each one, uh, we are finding the square value if it is even number. If it is even number, we are finding the square value also. Okay, let's execute, uh, explain the execution flow, guys. We will see the execution flow now. Right. So here, for loop is there. Then uh, if condition is there, and the uh, expression is there. Three parts, right? First for loop is good, sir. So the, from the list, uh, what's first time I value? First time I value five. That five going to here, check the condition. True or false, sir. There's a false. False means uh, skip the value. How much skipping here? How much skipping now? Which one is skipping here? The 5 is skipping, right? 5 is skipped. That's all. 
next uh, or next value two right next i value is two guys next uh, i value is the two now two going to if condition i check it now if for two modulus two equal zero true or false it is true if it is true then going to the expression the expression will execute if the condition is true only now i into i how much it's four right it's a four we can take the we can take the four here that's all right now so four over Next, what's the i value? I value is the eight. I value is the eight. Now, eight going to if condition. Uh, check the if condition. Eight modulus two equal to zero. True or false? It is the true. Then going to the expression. Now, eight into eight, uh, sixty-four, right? Then uh, the sixty-four coming here. The sixty-four coming here, comma, like uh, sixty-four, right? Next one. Next, uh, take the sixty-four. Right. Ah, uh, next one. Seven is there, right? Next, ah, uh, seven is there. I value seven. I value seven. Then going to if condition true or false, ah, uh, it is false. If is the false for seven, so seven will skip. Right. Next one, ah, uh, I value is the six. Next, I value is the six. Six is coming here. Then uh, going to if condition. Six modulus two equal zero. True or false? It is true. Going to expression of uh, six into six. Ah, uh, okay. How much? Thirty-six, right? Ah, uh, thirty-six guys. This is the thirty-six. Okay, thirty-six. That's all. Ah, uh, next one. Ah, uh, next one. Ah, uh, nine. Nine is coming here. So I value is the nine. The nine going to expression nine into nine. Ah. Uh, So nine na uh, is two or uh, even or odd it's odd number right so skip it na uh. nine is uh, skipping here next ah uh, what next one na uh, next one is that ten na uh. so I value ten then going to condition check the condition true or false it is true then na uh, going to expression now ten square uh, how much it is the hundred right ten square is the hundred uh, that's all now all limits over right. So I want to set in the list format. Square brackets are taken, right? So we'll take the square brackets. We'll take the square brackets. Print right? is there, so that it's printing like this, printing like this, right? So this is the one of the ways uh, to find the squares of all even numbers. Okay, right? Thank you a lot, guys. Bye.